In this lockdown, many people and families are forced to be stuck in their own homes and also lowers the amount of exercise a student can get. In this video, I'm starting this campaign project about why you should start exercising every day and how you can exercise every day as a student. To start things off, the thing that we mostly do when we are locked in our house is just stare at a screen. Students like can spend around 10 or more hours in this. With my research, this can lead to back problems, eye dryness, fatigue, and blurred vision to our eyes. Moving causes your muscles to release molecules like lipoprotein lipase, which helps process the fats and sugar to eat. When you spend most of your day sitting and not getting tired, the release of these molecules is lessened and your rear ends at greater risk of widening. In other words, you gain weight at a faster rate if you sit down too much and eat all day. This can also lead to worse problems such as obesity and uh, type 2 diabetes. Not only that, but being tired is more important than you think. When not exposed to exercise, students usually stay up late at night and become sleep deprived, which causes drowsiness, difficulty concentrating, and depression to the immune system. Students also get a lack of vitamin D, which is vital for maintaining healthy bones and contributes to high growth. Vitamin D deficiency can also uh, lead to a lot of bone density, which can contribute to osteoporosis and fractures of human bone. Right now, if students only exercise once a week, it will really affect their body. Because by exercising every day, students will not only lower the amount of screen time they take, they will also start to sleep earlier, get more vitamin D, and will overall be more healthy. I'm going to show you um, some exercises you can do in this lockdown. Exercising in the pandemic doesn't mean that you have to stay at home. Right now, you are still allowed to go outside, but you're not allowed to go in the gym. This exercise will focus more on calisthenics, and it will be quick so you can do your school activity. The first exercise is a 1km walk or run. You don't need to walk too far because you'll be doing it every day. Cycling is also optional, but you'll have to double the distance. And remember, cardio doesn't necessarily make you stronger, but it makes you overall healthier and build up stamina. If your parents really don't allow you to go outside, you can do this indoor cardio building exercises to keep you healthy. Do a sunbathe for 10 minutes to get all the vitamin D, and do this indoor exercises. 30 seconds of jumping jacks, 1 minute of plank, and 15 burpees. Here's my campaign poster that I drew myself in the software. Thank you for listening to my campaign, and remember to keep exercising.